uh, Robert Streets. I have used MIDI hardware sequencers before, but I would like to know how to set up Ubuntu as a MIDI sequencer. Do you think you would ever do a show about that? Certainly could. Um, I haven't done MIDI in, in years upon years. Um, I, I got into like FL Studio. Uh, well, before that, I was doing Impulse Tracker. Like that's how far back I go as far as music creation goes, uh, and even Screen Tracker 3 and uh, things like that. Um, so if you're sticking with MIDI, I would look at, at a program called Rose Garden. I'm just going to type it into my address bar. It takes me to rosegardenmusic.com. Um, so this is, this is something that's available for free uh, cross-platform and gives you not just the multi-tracking, but it's got the MIDI sequencing and things like that as well. So give, I, haven't, I haven't used that in a long time. I'm sure that it's come a long way since I've used it. Um, but take a look at it and see if that uh, is something that would uh, be good for you. Let's see if it's in uh, Synaptic Package Manager too. That would be interesting to know. Synaptic Package Manager being an application that allows us to install uh, programs in Ubuntu Linux. So I've brought that up from System, Administration, Synaptic Package Manager. This would just be the easiest way to install it if it's in here, and I don't even know. Oh, it is. There we go. Rose Garden, MIDI Editor and MIDI Audio Sequencer, or Music Editor. Um, so yeah, give that a try. I'd say that's probably a good starting place anyways, for sure. 